Hello, my friends. On this beautiful music of my friend David Lastra, with so much love, I talk about his music all the time and I promote his music. I have a nice video for you, which is not very, uh, I don't know, advertised though. I haven't seen this video as much. It's a video of Jonathan. When he just started his collaboration with Halo App, a very, I don't know, different interview. You see a lovely lady taking an interview of him, and a very interesting exchange there too. But what am I talking about? Let's take a look, shall we? The music, peace of mind. I pray in the name of Jesus that you have peace of mind. I pray that you have peace in, of mind like uh, everyday occurrence. Today, and if we reach tomorrow, and if we reach the day after tomorrow, peace of mind will be in your life, my friend, that you are watching this video. And I pray the same for myself, because there is nothing more important than peace of mind. So let's take a look now. Three, two. I talk about a lot throughout my book that how we, you know, respond to pressure matters, but how we prepare matters just as much. And so it's a lot to do, you know, with being able to stand firm under pressure doesn't just happen from a place of just adrenaline and hoping that you have what it takes in the heat of the moment, but it's the moments leading up to that moment that prepare you to be able to stand firm. And I talk a lot about, you know, just the importance of having that intimate relationship with the Lord and having those quiet and alone moments with the Lord to where you're really feeding your spirit and you're investing in in those quiet moments is when you're discovering like, who am I? What do I really believe? What does God's word say? And really where you're building that faith so that when moments of pressure come or when storms of life come or whatever it is, temptation comes at you, like you already have what it takes to stand. And I always like to say when pressure hits, what's inside of you is what's gonna come out of you. Mm -hmm. And so it matters what's inside. It matters how you're preparing and how you're spending those alone and quiet moments. You were made for this moment. And what does that, what does that look like to you? What does that mean to you? How can you walk out of here and walk into your field and in what you're doing with the confidence that I was made for this moment? I think it's by continuing to submit myself to his will. I think it's reminding myself that I have to listen to his voice and really discern what he would want me to do, mm. you know? And then by doing that and allowing him to lead, then I'm doing just that. I that was the video. A bit different, isn't it? Jonathan as well looks different. You can see that this video is from at least three, four years ago. He doesn't even talk as much. But who said that uh, the quality is in the quantity? <laughs> it was never like this. We are bombarded with a lot of information and nowadays, isn't it? Loads and loads. And uh, the quality in uh, that quantity is less than 1%, isn't it? Thank you for watching. God bless you all. See you very soon.